Hey everyone! Welcome back to some more Let's Play Bug Fables. In the last episode, we came back to the Ant Kingdom at the behest of Zosp, who had been panicking since the Ant Kingdom had fallen under attack from the Wasps. They sought the artifact, and the Wasp King was here to take it from the Ant Queen. He was quite powerful, but Maki looks like he might have been a match for him. After our band of heroes failed to destroy the king, Maki had shown up and scared the Wasp away. And now our next, next task is to retrieve the piece of the artifact that he had taken from us. When he downed Leaf, he was able to grab it. There's a great amount of power in that artifact. We don't want it being held by the Wasps. So that's our next objective. But we're going to do a bunch of side quests and other miscellaneous stuff first, because we're not really under, under a time limit. <laughs> then, off screen. I decided to try my hand at fighting the Pitcher Plant, optional battle again. And after about an hour, like an hour and uh, ten minutes or so, trying hard mode over and over again with all sorts of different medals, I either kept messing up, I kept doing the wrong things, and or it is too difficult. So I put it on normal, and it still beat the heck out of me several times. <laughs> and finally! Finally we were able to beat it last night. I was muted while I was doing it because I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to do it. I figured I might as well record it if I could. And that was a nice surprise ending, I think, for that video. Wow. Picture plant beaten. But it was on normal, and I didn't... S oh, we did scan it because I was using my auto scanner, if I recall correctly. Speaking of auto scanner, and I was alluding to metals, here's what I currently have equipped again. Putting back on the hard mode metal. Now, this does mean that we beat a boss, the first boss and or mini boss, without a medal. This means that that medal can show up at the shops for us to purchase now, instead of us getting it for free. Just a heads up. Welcome. Oh, it's you! We have a 1,059 berries in your account right now. What will it be? Let's withdraw. Very well. How much are you willing to take out? Let's take out 59. 1,000 berries still in there. Okay. I've done some inventory stuff off-screen, as I said I was going to do, and I created some new things with the flower. Uh... Crap. I forget what sweet pudding is. How did I make it? <laughs> I don't remember, but you guys should know. Let's see. Oh, alright. So I made a sleep bomb, which is a spicy bomb and a numbnail dart. I made a... a sweet pudding. Bag of flour and an aphid egg. There we go. Poison cake, which is a danger shroom and some flour. And mushroom gummies, which is a mushroom and some flour. I figured I might as well start trying to fill out the rest of our recipes. And now with all that said, we're going to do some more side questing. So, the first thing we're going to do is purchase a new song, because I got some money out. C can I play something for you? Absolutely. Play the outskirts for us. Uh, a new song is a first time fee of two berries. Is is that okay with you? Here you go. Oh, okay. I'm going to try my best. Let me know if you like it. I like it. No new quests right now. I'll keep you posted. Anything else I can help you with? No oh, thanks. No worries. Be sure to check back for anything else. Lost item. I've lost a collector's item. Last time I saw it, it was somewhere in the Sunset Inn. Meet me at the Fight Roots' discreet place for the reward when you find it. That's a very interesting looking shady character. It's almost like we've seen him someplace before. And we have the thing that he lost. The Mothiva doll. All right, well, let's get back out there. So we're going to do some miscellaneous stuff. I probably should store... 
you want to store some stuff, Tim? I don't need all these honeyed leaves on me. At least I don't think I do. So let's go ahead and leave a handful of these here. We'll leave... Oops. Well, I want to leave two of them. I only left one. Let's do that again. Okay. So I guess we'll go to the... Let's do this quest first. We'll head to the Defiant Root. See who that person is, but then we'll double back here. Oh, sorry, we'll go to the Golden Settlement so that we can start on exploring a little bit more. But we'll want to reach the gold. Oh, sorry, the Golden Hills. But we'll want to go through there from the Ant Kingdom side entrance, not the Golden Settlement's side entrance. I'm going the wrong way. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Ant. Mrs. Ant. Alright, so we want the fight route. Now, where is that discreet place? The well? Maybe it's the well. I don't see any shitty individual here. He's not going to be back in that area. I don't see him up top. Is he in here? Oh, we still have to get the lotion for her. We have not found an umbrella, nor have we been able to craft any lotion. I'm pretty sure there is something you can make for her. But I, I haven't been able to figure it out yet. We should keep our eyes open. Oh, right, we also wanted to have Leaf speak with a few of these folks, too. No, he's not here. Is it in the poison area? Oh, we also want to be charmed again, since we lost that charm in our battle against the king. That could have also helped me against the, uh, the pitcher plant as well, I suppose. This guy has no new berries. I guess he only sells two of them. I haven't seen him get any other berries yet. Oh, here he is. Hello, mysterious. Obviously not a wasp person. You. Hmm? Nothing. Have you found the thing? Yes! Uh... Thanks. Here's your reward. You found a heart berry. This rare berry brings good health when eaten. Prem increases the ally's hit points by one. This never happened. I'll be going now. Don't trip on the way to that concert. <laughs> hey! That guy looks familiar. D does he? Could this be... Nothing else to say, huh? Hello there, lovelies. Welcome to my humble stall. Here, oh boy, we've already read this. Overcharm, please. There you go. Now you're all charmed up. Who knows how we'll help you out. Might even get you out of a pinch. Come back later when you want more charms. All right, so... Who's going to eat that berry? I think we'll give this one to V. She's occasionally taking hits. Let's see. Is there anyone else we should talk to? 26 berries left. I can't think of anything else we have to make, so let's now head back and do the things outside I was going to do without getting too distracted. So, we're going to go back to the Ant Kingdom in order to go to the Golden Hills from the Ant Kingdom's entrance. There's some things we can dig up on the way there. Things that we'll need Kabu to sprout up out of the ground to reveal. And if they are dark cherries, if we get two dark cherries, we might just roll right around, come back, and store those. By the way, uh, dark cherries are worth 50 gold to purchase, and I think you sell them for the same price, if I remember correctly. So in other words, if you're not going, you can always get the money, put it in the bank, and come back later and rebuy what you sold. Since you're not losing out on anything when you do that. Oh, by the way, is this place open now? Nope, still no. 
Okay, so it's gonna be this way, Tim. Oh, I don't really want to... F I mean, I do want to fight them. Oh, I suppose I should mention... I did fight a golden seedling, but I w Oh, we can't get there yet. Okay, well, so much for that idea. I did fight a golden seedling, but it ran away after I hit it four times. So we probably have to use a frost... or uh, a frigid coffin to stop it from running so we can actually kill it. Remember that we don't have the... Uh, well prepared metal equipped. Oh my god! Please, another lore park! Oh my god, these are not a reward! <laughs> we better get something amazing when we get every single lore book finally found. I'm just saying, that's, a, that's quite a bit of work. Saw nothing. I, mi I missed all those on purpose. We don't actually need the clear water, so we're just gonna leave that here. Let's save the game. So if we die, we start back here. All right. Oh, I have the thing we got from defeating the pitcher plant, but I didn't turn it in. We'll do that later. Oh, do I? Yeah, let's fight it. Any battle which has a seedling could spawn a golden seedling, as I've mentioned. Now that I've seen one, I would love to be able to fight another one of them. That's a 1% chance, so the odds are not very good. I forgot we healed two hit points at the end. Now, Tim, that metal equipped, you don't have to worry about feeling so much like you used to. Okay, so we're going this way. For this, yes, of course, for this. I totally saw this. A dark cherry. Oh, wonderful. Let's see. That's, I don't think that leads to any. I guess we should check. Two are no problem. Knock you down. Oh, actually, they, they might be a problem, Tim. Hmm. We do only one damage with Kaboot, Tim. Let's turn Relay to V. She'll heal that. We don't need any TP restored. <laughs> These medals, by the way, the TP and life restore, come into play when you're doing the boss rush or mini boss modes as well. Just as a heads up. I don't think there's something for us to dig up up here, but I'm gonna, I wanna check really quick. There is not. Nothing back there either. Okay. And we can't crawl around on the thorns down there. But we should be able to... And I think in the area to the left here... I don't need to fight you, snail. Might as well get a single berry from all of these while we're in the area. Although, not well, Tim, no. Don't. You have a thousand berries. You don't need any more. Oh, stop. What are you doing? You don't need to, you don't need to do that. Actually, we, we did need to do that. <laughs> but not the length of time I thought I, I had to do that for. Alright, this is... Wait. Is, is this right? Woo! 
barely made it. I know there's a weevil. There it is, over here somewhere. This is this is the place we want. Let's see. Let's go down here. Kill this seedling. Get it out of our way. Oh, hmm. She'll do three damage there. If I want to kill the Weevil, and I do, then she needs to be up front. Weevil is more dangerous than the seedlings are. with two hit points, so I'll use a secret stash on her. Okay, she's still healed fully. Take that, seedling. You weren't able to actually cause us to lose hit points here. Okay. Now we can actually explore this little area to get there. Before we do that, though, I want to check around and make sure there's nothing else secreted, like, back here. I don't think there is. There is not. I don't know how this protects you from thorns. I guess it moves them out of the way. Okay. And this is a tough area. We have uh, some new things in this spot. Yeah. Bigger versions of the Chompers. You wanna... You wanna fight them. You wanna scan them. Let's see. Let's start with a frigid coffin. Good, good. Turn me to him again. Put Kaboo in the front. We can kill that one if I have Kaboo go again. So we'll have him do that. Now we can scan this one. Uh, who wants to scan it? We'll have these scan it. Whoa! What do they feed this thing? We gotta be careful! Let's gang up on it before it makes too many chompers! 23 hit points on that thing, too. Wow! This is gonna be this is gonna be really stupidly tough. If I don't want to use too much TP, and I don't. I think that you have to use a, a hurricane toss here or something of the sort.
Man, this is stupidly tough. <laughs> Good God! I remember this area being very, like, more diff kind of difficult on normal mode. On hard, this armor the chompers have is really annoying. You can't kill the little chomper without you focusing on it. Like, I'll have to tell you, Tim. You. Okay, that time I didn't spit. Can we kill this, though? I don't think we can do a damage to it if it's uh, also armored. Because we can't flip it. Close. <laughs> that was one of them. And I think some of these battles have two giant chompers. Crunchy leaf. Oh, thank goodness. Something to heal us a little bit. And we brought lots of stuff with us, so this won't be as difficult as I'm making it out to be. But it's going to be annoying. Okay. Let's save the game so we don't have to do that battle again and push on. Once again, we could probably just ignore these things, but where's the fun in that? We, we want to do every single battle at least once. And I mean every single one of them, so let's do this battle too. Oh! <laughs> oh! Okay. Uh, we're going to spend a lot of TP here, so we're going to do a dash through. Then I want to turn Relay back to Kaboo so we can put Leaf in the front. Ah, uh, you know what? No. In fact, you have to leave him. You have to do this. Okay. So let's Frigid Coffin. Good. Keep it from doing anything for a turn. Okay. That's, that's all I got. Alright, so how are we doing this, Tim? Man. We'll do one more point of damage thanks to the fact, with, with like a tornado toss, thanks to the fact that V is in the front and it is armored. So let's you do a tornado toss here. Kabu can taunt. It still may do the three seed spit, I think. And we need to restore some TP. So let's use... Oh, I did not bring any... Okay. I didn't bring any crispy berries. I thought I for sure I did that. I'm gonna try to wait till after this battle's over. We do two damage with leaf. We do. I think we can kill it without needing to use abilities. 
if everyone hits it. leaf and a poison cake you get them from here how about that i had to make one <laughs> all right well that's fantastic because we could really use one of these using them outside of combat means that we're not going to be poisoned either i don't think we need to use the crunchy leaf so i was planning to use a poison cake anyway interesting that they dropped them whoa holy crap we will of course fight to all comers. Okay, this is not nearly as bad. Let's start with Kaboo. I'll turn Relay to him. Oh! I turned Relay with the wrong person. Okay. Because I want Leaf in the front, but now he won't be able to turn Relay... Well, he wasn't going to turn Relay anyway. Um... And Kaboo still can. Okay, so let's go ahead and Ice Fall. Oh! That's perfect. And I do nothing with Kaboo. And now we can kill this one. We're healed a little bit and we made back some of our TP. We get another crunchy leaf. Good place for those, I guess. Oh! See that crack in the wall? There'll be something in there. We can bury through that with Kaboo. Oh, this again. Okay, well, same plan as before then, right? Only this time, I remember to turn Relay with V, not with Leaf to start. Then we come here and we once again do an Ice Fall. Kaboo's already gone, but it's in ice, so we should kill it. He did not. That's awkward, Tim. That was that was really stupid of you. <laughs> Should have focused on the same one instead of doing what, whatever it was it you just did. Another crunchy leaf. Let's go ahead and use one that we have then. That'd be a tough, tight fit, but we can do it. What is this? If I didn't know any better, I'd say that that looks like a nail. You find a Berserker Medal. Increases the allies' attack by three, but makes them unable to use skills, blocking, items, relay, or to be relayed to. That probably would have been handy to give to... Uh, no. No, it wouldn't have been. If you can't use skills? I don't... I'd have to think about who would actually want to use that. I guess I just don't have a build capable of actually utilizing it. All right, we're gonna kill this one. Oh, no, we're not. We're gonna dodge its attack. I think we got it while it was stunned. We did. All right, so this is big attack time. So let's see, how do we wanna do this? I like using Kaboo first because if, depending upon what I freeze, I don't, I'm not sure if I want to use him a second time. We'll do the standard opening that we've been doing. And do an ice fall next. Okay, that worked out. 
So, I'll turn Relay to V. Who can kill the thing in the back. I'm just gonna let that thing exist. I don't need to kill it. So let's just end our turn. Okay, and now we'll try killing this. I think Kibu taunts. Sweet! Uh, sure, just attack. I think we'll frigid cough in this round. Nice, very good. Okay, I'm about to say it still has 13 hit points. No, it does not. Okay, can I do eight? I think we can do eight points of damage to it since it's frozen. Without using any more TP. Close. But just barely enough damage. Another crunchy leaf. Okay, let's use the poison cake. Since we're not in combat. Oh, we get a drowsy cake also. What's with all the cakes? And that fills up our inventory at the moment, too. We I mean, had to do this. We'll have to probably get this one on the edge. Oh, I don't know if we can... If we can do this. Is there another water drop? Uh-oh. We may be here too early. I know of a way to do this, but I don't think we can do it currently. Oh, oh, we can. Thank God, just barely. That's two big chompers, and one of them gives, gives me trouble. Hmm. Okay. Let's hit the small one to start. Use a ice fall and see what we're going to do. Uh, no, let's hit this one again. They can just resummon it, so this is arguably not doing much for me. Good. So Kabu doesn't need to do anything this round. Put three damage on the front one? That doesn't seem like that's worth doing. We could put more damage on it with a heavy strike. I don't know if that's worth I don't think it's worth doing it. I think the I think not getting attacked for one turn is more important. Okay. So Let's put your cough in the one in the back to keep it from acting. We taunt with Kaboo. 
and we'll use a burly candy on him. It can't be helped him. You just, you just have to... You have to go crazy and go crazy. We, ha we have to... I have to... Spend TP. <laughs> you have to spend lots of TP here. Yeah, we have to. Alright, let's put your cough in this thing. Now that that one's frozen for a little bit, we can go ahead and use a... Tornado Toss here? Hurricane Toss would ignore one point of armor. Let's do that instead. And then we taunt again. Perfect blocks. Every one of those. That was amazing. We do anything. Except use a crunchy leaf. Okay. Do you get to go in the front? Or do we actually, we, I think we did. No, we just taunt with them. I feel like I should get to do that. <laughs> I don't like that at all. Frigid coffee. And I can kill it if I use a hurricane toss. TP got used. Haven't seen that since COVID. And we get another crunchy leaf. There's at least one, yep, one more big chomper. Can we avoid that one? Oh! This battle again. Oh, Tim, you only have four TP, so this is going to be a, a slugfest, this particular battle. We might as well use an ice fall. Good. Mostly to stop that last one from acting. damage to it than that. I think this may level us, though, if we are su if we are successful here. Since we're out of TP, though, if this thing decides to summon something, we're gonna have to start using items that give us more back again, because we just don't do... Guess let's just try. You haven't saved in a while, Tim, by the way, so if you start losing people, this is really bad. I, for 
forgot they healed. If they hit me. Have to use honey leaf because I need to buy some time which fit with a rigid coffin. Eight damage to it with one armor, I think. If I don't attack it, well, no. Let's let's do. Does that level us? No. There was another battle here. So we could do that to fully heal. That's a that's a at least one big one though. We'll do a Venus flower here. Let's talk with this. Hey guys, Venus here. Have you come for healing? Just fork over eight berries. Here you go, some Venus special healing. Now there's no save unfortunately here. This is goodbye again. Most up for a chat. So I think what we're going to do. Oh! But there is a save here now. Without me having to double all the way back. Well. There's a boss battle up ahead. I don't think it's one of the special boss battles that you ha that you can do, but it might be. In which case, I should probably get the quest for that first. Let me go off screen, and I'll be back. I'm gonna go check on the quest board at the the secret place by the shops in the Ant Kingdom. And if there's no quest for it, I'll be right back here. Alright guys, I ran all the way back and there is no quest for this particular boss. I remember what I remember what boss it was. Uh, I think we could probably benefit from having more metal points. So we're gonna go ahead and get some more metal points. So let's start with an ice fall. Good, got both of them. And then we can actually go crazy, Tim, with the TP here because you have you have heal. Uh, no, we'll heal at the end of this, Tim. Which means there is no reason for me to hold back. Another ice falls the way you do this. That way you do even more damage to the front one. No, but no, we'll just put your coffin the one in the back. I'll taunt this front one. Perfect block. I 
I think this kills it. It does not. One hit point left. Because that's a charge, by the way, I looked up what charge does. After, well, actually, I was trying to use it against the pitcher plant uh, at the end of the last episode. Uh, you get to keep this until you actually use charge. That's why I decided to hold on to it right here. That was dumb. Yeah, because now I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Well, I guess we could just pass. This, this was dumb. I should have attacked first. So I guess we can keep it frozen. Oh, or not! We need to kill the thing in the back, no matter what. So V up front will do, I think, four damage to it with her charge plus one. And then I think we can kill this one. No, one hit point left. Cool. What was that? <laughs> what was that? What'd you do for us? All right, well done, Ranka. Metal points. It's gonna be hard now to compete with that as what we want every single level. Kabu has learned Frozen Drill. And we get another crunchy leaf. Okay. Let's save the game again. Actually, let's put the badges on first. So. Three more points. Spy specs for us, because I know there's a boss battle up ahead. And I think I want break or impact. Oh, you know what? I was actually doing very well with the with the uh, status relay, wasn't I? But that's also only one point, so I don't know what I would... I don't have a whole very many other one-point medals. I guess we could scan it for a turn. Spy specs. And we'll take in people. Although, if you're going to relay back and forth to Kaboo, you could do the trick you were doing. How much is well prepared? Is it one or two for that? It's two, isn't it? Strong starts... That's, that's well prepared. It's two for strong start. No, strong start. Oh, it's two for that, though, Tim. Spice Specs is better for one. Let's do this. All right, game is saved. Boss music, awesome. All right, we've already technically spied it. So let's do. Let's do an ice fall first and see how many of them are frozen. That will determine what I'm going to do with the rest of my characters. Okay, we probably can't freeze the thing in the back, is my guess. Let's taunt here. 
It's really tempting to just whack one. So let's do that and get rid of one of the little ones. Those are sleep seeds, I just realized. Or shock seeds. I'll put Kubu up front and he'll kill this little one. I'm going to enfeeble to lower her damage output. And then I think we use an item this round. to not use Leaf until there's another one out, and then we can Ice Fall for incredible damage with him. And we Taunt with Kaboo again. Oh, what does this do? Leaf creates an Ice Spike while Kaboo bursts from underground, flipping an enemy with a chance to freeze it, but it's 8 TP. Let's stick with what we know. a little low on TP points. Hmm. We're not going to have enough to finish this combat without using something like my shock candy. Which I guess we could use now. They're taunted. Let's use it. Still shocked. Oh, for two more turns, though. Oh, I didn't realize it was going to last so long. He's also asleep for seven turns. I'll put him up front, though. He'll heal a little bit each turn. And he's got extra defense up there. He's also more likely to be attacked by everything. So we'll do that. And we'll use an Ice Fall. Which, will, which should do six damage to them. I kind of don't want to kill the little one in the back, because it's a, just a little one. But nah, let, let's use it. Oh, I missed the front one. That's super awkward. Oh, Tim. She heals if you don't block. I think you misplayed that badly. Kind of asleep already. <laughs> we'll put him asleep again. Oh, I 
totally did not block. Did she heal seven hit points? Okay, we, uh, we've lost. So, uh... I, I guess we'll keep trying. But this is, this is over. Okay, mental note. Taunting or doing something with Kaboo was really bad. Uh, doing anything but taunting with Kaboo was really bad. We should be taunting with him all the time. Uh, because now we're, we're in dire straits. I did not bring enough stuff for this fight. Oh! It can add defense to her! That's annoying! We need to keep her enfeebled at all times. Tim, you should be taunting with him. Power is still down for one more turn. You're gonna have to pretty much perfect block though, Tim. I don't think she can be frozen. I'm not killing it this turn. It gets two actions this turn. Can we cleanse it of that extra action? I'm out of items. We, we had to use way too many. We still taunt. Even if it kills him. I need to see if we can cleanse her. We cannot. Alright, so that was a waste. I don't understand what counts as a... ...cleansable thing. I can't do 17 points of damage. I, I just can't do it. Especially because we're out of TP. So, this is over. Yeah, this is over. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, this is this is totally doable. Uh, let me check my medals again before we go back in there. Alright, so let's see. So, we want spy specs. I think if people's very... I think it's... Do we need spiky bod? The only thing we- we don't hurt her because she's spitting. She does do the bite, but I don't think Spiky Bod's probably worth using. Let's see what else we have. No, I don't want Berserker. I think we'll go back to using the status relay trick. And I'll give Shock Trooper to Kaboo? 
we might shock him on purpose one round after he taunts. Okay. So, we want V in the front to do an extra point of damage. We want Kabu to taunt, and I want to... I want to... Uh, well, I guess there's two ways to look at this, isn't there? No matter what, I want to taunt with Kabu. I could bubble shield him for three, in which case he won't take any damage despite all these attacks coming after him, whether or not I block. Or I could enfeeble her, the big plant, to reduce the damage she does by one for two turns. We will still take a bunch of damage. Maybe, maybe we bubble shield this first round. Sure. And then I guess we start working on her? Or do we hit these little ones to clear them first? Frigid Coffin might be really useful, but I'm going to want to also power her down, and I also still want to taunt. Let's Frigid, uh, Frigid Coffin. Let's Ice Fall first. doing plus one damage. I don't want her doing that. That's already very powerful. Let's, uh, enfeeble her. Kabu taunts. I haven't done any damage to her yet, Tim. Zero. You've done z Well... A tiny bit of damage to her we've done. A taunt. And this time we'll use the shock candy. Because he'll take no damage. And now we can finally start working on the boss. He's still frozen, so he's still not going to take any damage. Let's put him up front this time. Oh, Tim, that was dumb. You want to do the... Well, actually, this is... It'll be fine. 
because she keeps the plus one attack. Ignored Kabu entirely. Uh, well, crap. This is awful. Well, that actually worked out very well, but she's gonna get two attacks and heal both times? That's just awful. We have to taunt. We need Kabu to take all of this. She's getting two attacks. We actually should have probably had more shock candy. That that was a pretty good strategy. Uh We're all a little hurt, but mushroom gummies are gonna help me. We need to impa Oh, actually bubble shield light will work. And then we can hurricane toss. We're not killing it this round. Have to taunt. We need more TP. We have to have that. I only have a honeyed ice cream. But I need to TP now. That sucks. Okay, no problem. Uh, so we can use the honey ice cream on Kabu. And then we can... Oh, he's frozen for two turns. Bubble shield light. die. If she bites him, this is over. And she can only be plus three. Okay, so we lost plus one charge. Still, I think this might kill her. We have to hurricane. Okay. Let's put your coffin to start. Hopefully we can do 13 damage with this, or it's over for us. It's still not done, much to my surprise, but this is far easier to deal with. the chomper seed. A baby chomper seed. Maybe a scientist would know what to do with this. 
and that seems to be all that's in here. That was fun! Close! As with most of these boss battles on hard mode, I just barely do it when I am victorious, which is fantastic. I feel like that's the way it should be. Hey guys, Venus here. Have you come for some healing? Here you go. Please come by again. I'm always up for a chat. And with that, I think that's... Yeah, we played for an hour. Let's first go ahead and take these off. And put back on Spiky Bod. Oh, hold on. Shock Trooper we don't need either, right? Status Relay. So I had on Spiky Bod. Oh, right, Tim, you leveled up. What other things you want normally? Crazy Repaired and... I like the status re- Oh, it's only one for that. Right. Mmm. I'll take him power. Actually, no. No, no, no. Let, let's take Enfeeble. Or Break. At the moment, at least. And why not? Let, let's travel. Let's go back to town. We can turn in several things now. And it's probably fastest if we go back to town the way we came here. I thought this area was closer to the Ant Kingdom's entrance, not the Golden Settlement. I apologize again for the fan. Ooh, one Tim first, one this one first. Uh, it's again about 90 degrees outside in early uh, April, early August, early early April. Which is a, a bit warm. We're breaking records, or we're tying records here in New Jersey today. And tomorrow's gonna be more of the same. And then we're back down into 70s and 50s. Which is a lot more acceptable. Oh, God! Acceptable. And I just reacted. Which is super bad, because I'm not killing... I'm not... Uh, we are killing this. Everyone has to attack it. I guess we're also walking out of there with a lot of crunchy leaves. Oh, and a thumbnail dart, too. Maybe we can make some sleepy cake. Man, we had to use everything we brought with us, though, Tim, didn't you? I didn't use the leaf omelet or mushroom bear gummies during that fight. Everything else we picked up on the way to the place. How about that? I'm making it tougher for myself, too, because I'm doing some of these battles not without the best things we could bring with us. Like the dark cherry pie we made, for example, would have been incredible to help me fight the pitcher plant. As will the thing this chomper seed will bring to us eventually. But we'll turn that in in the next episode. With this done, we should check to see what Malby wants. Sounds like we're going back to the factory. I think it was our 20-something experience points, too. Holy crap. All right. Let's save. Let's turn in some stuff. Yeah, we beat that boss on hard, so let's see what we get. Hey, you're back. Let's see how you've been doing with that medal of mine. Hmm. Good job, folks. You've that hardened mother chomper. 
Was it too challenging for you? You deserve a reward. Here, take this. You got a TP core medal. The party recovers two TP every two turns. Come back later when you've bought some extra hard heads with that medal, will ya? Holy crap, that's amazing! How expensive is it? Five? That sounds like a five one. Uh, Berserker is freaking six? Why? That's not worth six. That's worth three, given all the horrible things that happened to you. I guess this lets someone like V, though, just insta-kill someone each turn. Up front, she would have an attack of six, for example. It's only three for the TP core. Well, I'm going to take the TP core, then. Hold on. Why not? We'll have all of the restora uh, restorative medals on us. Uh, we have 182 berries, too, from our adventure. Wow! Okay, so the first thing we want to do is do a little bit of cooking. We have... Three crunchy leaves and a numbnail dart. How do I make the cakes? How do I make a sleepy cake? Drowsy cake. Bag of flour, numbnail dart. Okay. Hmm. I do like my honeyed leaves. That would make a leaf omelet. Let's get a breakfast. We'll carry all this stuff with us. The combined stuff's always better than the cooking stuff singularly. At least for healing TP-wise. Chop chop! Come on, let's get messy! Give me what you want to cook! Oh, we got some hungry bugs! First ingredient! Now! Second ingredient! Now! What what I give him? A honey drop. So, honey drop and crunchy leaf. You sure? No refunds. Watch our master do his work. Here it is. A masterwork. Eat up, small fry. Crunchy leaf actually isn't the best compared to some of the other things we could probably be making at this moment, but it's still very good. Well, I, uh... Maybe I'm, maybe I'm, I'm, I think I'm exaggerating a bit. It's a, it's decent. It heals a good amount, gives you back some TP. So you, in an emergency, which I guess not an emergency, when things aren't going so well, but and you need a quick recovery, it's very. It's a, I think it's, a, it's one of the better things to get. Well, did we learn uh, uh, an, I think an egg and the flowers the best thing. It's six hit points and six TP restored. I thought Tim. Make a breakfast. Okay. That's eight items. We're going to make... Uh, yeah, we'll probably make a drowsy cake. We can, uh, we can make another... You know, I'm curious. But it's a dark cherry. They're so expensive to, if, you, if you mess it up. I'm thinking maybe a dark cherry and a magic seed could make something for us. By the way, did I use my magic seed? I did during that, during the boss battle. I'm surprised I recovered then. Okay, so we need another one of those. But first, let's turn in our quest here. Check really quick if there's anything else for sale here. Defense booster. And what does this one do again? If the equipped ally is attacked directly while poisoned, the attacker has a chance of getting poisoned. Uh, okay, let's turn this the quest in first. Back already? Ah, I oh, it's called Devour. I see you defeated that nasty Devour. Might have that crystal it dropped. Yes, this is a genuine deal. Here is your reward. You got the last attack medal. Increases the ally's attack by one when low on hit points. You got 50 berries. Nice doing business with you. 
always find the other bounties and your reward will be waiting. How many metal points is that? I'm probably not equipping it unless it's like one. Four. That's worthless. Or maybe it's good. I, I don't like it. I don't... A quick statement here. Hollow Knight had what I consider this problem. You're supposed... I've always felt that you balance these by t by the metal point equipage or like uh it was charms over in hollow knight so the more powerful charms were worth more charm slots but then they also added negative effects to charms to balance them out i've never i've never liked that balance it by either of them this should be like two metal points or even one metal point because you're taking a big risk by leaving their attack, uh, by leaving their hit points low. Why is it more expensive than... It definitely should not be more expensive than three, I feel. Yeah, I, I don't like it. I'll never equip it. I'm, I'm sure I'm probably in the minority, and everyone thinks it's the best metal ever. But I, I can't stand the things that are balanced twice like that. Hey there, come for some spy data? Oh, here! I had this super rare spy you didn't get yet. So this one's rare, have a 49 berries for it. Deal? Yes, let's take it. Alright, here you go. Your logbook has been updated with spy data for Mother Chomper. Do I not get the spy data if I have the spy specs equipped? Oh! I don't! I have to still spy! It just doesn't take me a turn! I misread that! Okay! How about that? Then I miss another one! At least one more! We have all the bosses that we didn't spy then! The Watcher. Yeah, we have the Scorpion, too. The Devourer. We probably have another. Yep. Golden Seedling. Okay. That sucks. <laughs> that sucks. I thought it gave me all the spy data as well as made it so I didn't spend an action. No, it's just free. Okay. Well, I'm not going to feel bad then. Late game run for about uh, two hours while I'm not doing anything so that I'm, I can get back all the berries that I spent right then because that was just awful now that I know how that works. Completely misread that. Oh. Okay, well. Let's end the episode. That sucks. That's, that's on your head, Totem. How about that? Alright, well now I know. I'm still going to let the game run in the background for about an hour or two. So I can make up the berries I use by getting the interest for free in the bank. So when we come back guys, you might see another like hour or two in my playtime. But that was just me letting the game run without doing anything. So I could, that could happen. So thank you guys for watching. This was a lot of fun. We got some, we got some stuff done. One side quest, one boss defeated. We we turned in some some of these quests. Oh, we have a dark cherry. I'll, I'll cook with it later. And we're going to go back now to the Bee Kingdom to visit the scientist and bring that chopper seedling there. While we're there, we can also see if we can get another upgrade for V's boomerang. So I'll see you guys in the next episode for all of that. Take care, everyone. And thanks for watching.